Yeah. This ain't wicked tonight. About two oh. o'clock right now. I waiting on somebody to come pick up this load from me. Um, so I can take my truck to the shop. Damn. Motherfucking lost the bumper, cuz. Lost my front bumper. Messing around with these mean potholes over here. I'm trying to tell you this mug. I don't know if niggas be eating the concrete. I don't know if this mug got concrete monsters. I don't know what the hell. But I'm talking about. Potholes, goddamn size of Texas for real. This shit crazy. And I'm in Texas. Luckily, there's a Kenworth shop not too far. So, try to make it there. You know what I'm saying? They open up about 7 o'clock, man. It's just crazy. Shoot, I probably slept for like maybe two hours, if that, before I hear the bump, bump, bump. Somebody knocking on my door. Here come the, uh, you know what I'm saying? Here come the people to, to try to fix my bumper. So we was messing around with that for like an hour. Um, I ended up buying some straps, you know, to ratchet and clamp. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we got the bumper back on there. It was secure, honestly, um, on the front. But the sides, sides of the front. It was hanging too low, way too low. So the mug was like, mug was like this, you know what I'm saying? Instead of like this. What the? Now time out. So, y'all, I'm basically getting just gonna get a whole new bumper now. They gonna hit me for that. Ew. But it is what it is, man. It's part of the game. So I'm just trying to keep moving. Man, it's it's just what happened when you when you trying to rush things. You know what I'm saying? Take your time with whatever you whatever you got going on. Take your time with it. You know what I'm saying? It's worth it. Um I was parking. I was doing a pull through, you know what I'm saying? Instead of backing in. Just cause you know, sometimes that's a little bit easier, but also I had about 11 minutes. You know what I'm saying? The time I'm allotted to drive every day. So, I mean, technically that's, you know, that's plenty of time to back my ass on in, man. It was already, you know, close to my, close to my time because I was going to stop. How it was set up, I was gonna stop about eight o'clock. You know what I'm saying? Or uh, I think it was, it was about seven o'clock. I was gonna stop about seven o'clock. You know what I'm saying? Then I'm about two hours away from my destination. And I was gonna sleep for eight, about eight hours. Basically, it was just cutting it too close. You know what I'm saying? Cause we always wanna have that extra hour. Um. Always want to have that extra hour in there, just in case traffic acting up, or you never know, just crazy situation. But so, you know what I'm saying? Got myself in a little pick on. Hey man, by the morning time, shit, it's gonna be like nothing happening. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just trying to keep it posy. That's all we can do right now. You dig.